I can kind of access it on on here. But I'll have I'll have a look with you later. Should, should be no no problem. <laughs> I don't really know how to fix it myself, but we'll break something until it fixes itself inadvertently. What is this? <laughs> That's the way to do it. What a mansion. Wow. Wow. What a mansion. Stop it. Okay. I'm half tempted just to dead off the glitch for a little bit because it's like it's like for, if you can do it, it's five seconds time save. Can you go? I'm going with you. Chris is our also, I am. Um, this is a new headset. Thank you for noticing. I'm joking. This is the same headset. It is a new headset, but I bought the exact same one. <laughs> the uh, ATH M40X Audio Technica. I was playing a game of Apex uh, a couple of nights ago, and I don't know. I heard like it, the, the headset felt really weird for some reason. Almost like. <laughs> it looks very similar. <laughs> what? What is you imagine people just do that on stream like, Wow, did, did you get a new headset? Your head shape's looking a bit like... <laughs> Instead of just noticing haircuts now, we just notice headsets. Whoa, dude, is, is that a new RGB keyboard you've got, man? Yeah, like a piece of it just kind of snapped off, so... I was a little sad, but thankfully, they're out of stock on Amazon for like two weeks. But I found a website that sold it for a few extra quid. When I delivered here. Because these are a great set of headphones. I just got to break them in, which I can already feel like after wearing them for an hour. My head is fucking huge. So like, to fit this bad boy on, it takes a little bit of breaking in. <laughs> I'm convinced it was my hair that broke it, somehow. Wesker! Help me look for him, Jill. And don't leave this hall for the time being. <laughs> when they say ha ha, just... Yo, Dave, how you doing? Oh, no frame perfect switch there. How you doing, dude? Hope you're having a good afternoon. Someone pointed out that when they type out, I read sarcastically. Especially when it's in lower caps as well. Just, uh... This is the a Audio-Technica ATH M40X. There's like loads of different ones. It's, it's a little pricey, but they're, they're really good. Um... I mean, when you consider the price of, like, gaming headsets, they're actually quite cheap. I'm good, thanks. Yeah, I, I saw um, Nox and, and Subs are playing it. I was going to play Resi 3, and then I was going to play Resi 2. And then I thought, you know what, I, 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 we come so close to our PB, like, I've barely put in any effort. If I just put in a little bit of effort, I might be able to PB on this. <laughs> Which would be nice. Subs so doing Yeah, no, I caught a bit of, um, I was lurking a little bit uh, while I was waiting for a delivery. Caught him doing a bit of a. Uh... Oh, yeah, no, that's what I saw him doing, funnily enough, was a uh, rocket launcher. Oh, he must have just unlocked it on the, on the mercenaries mode. New game plus. So I'm just going to not look at my splits today. Acid Nemi's getting. F <laughs> oh man, that's so. That's a, such a chill way to play as well. No fucking Acid Nemi, no valves, no having him. Uh, I carried a couple in, but there wasn't that many there, so I was like, you know what, boys, you do it. I'm just gonna wait and, uh, you know, stand guard. <laughs> so. is dangerous. Maybe it's better to secure our escape route first. There must be a back door somewhere. 
Let's try to find it first, shall we? Fucking acid Nemi. Try try back away from uh, from these rockets, dude. How does it feel? Uh, it's a bit like in that fucking mod when he just rapid fires you with the rocket launcher. <laughs> oh, I see. You're lazy. You gotta work smart, man, not hard. That's 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 my motto in life. I don't really know when the optimal time to equip this grenade launcher is. But I'll assume it's right now. I feel myself hunching forward. Can't have that. No worries, Sydney. Enjoy your afternoon, dude. Hit us with a quick day, man. I love you too. Have a good afternoon. <laughs> love it, dude. See, there is an actual song version of it. I just didn't know if that would get me DMCA'd, so. Like, if I order something from your company and you then send me four million emails asking me to rate your product, or like you'll review your website, it's not happening. Sorry. Just, just wondering why I had notifications. I was like, what? P people want to want to talk to me? No. I was watching some MGS2 speedruns the other day. And I really want to play it. Why is everyone playing this RE game? I don't really know. To be honest. Oh no, I, I mean, I didn't. I, I know a lot of streamers have kind of been doing Resident Evil story playthroughs over the last week. I, I don't. I, <laughs> I wonder what the reason is. It, it's probably just uh, the, the stars have all aligned up and. Everyone's coming on in. Yo, Sen, how you doing? But I mean, when you've got voice acting like this, like... Why wouldn't you want to play this game today? It's not the anniversary, is it? No, it's definitely not the anniversary of this game. <laughs> the hive mind speedrun mentality is just... just it's all into one. Richard, hold on. There's just going to be one time submitted on the boards now. Oh, no. It's going to be everybody. Have some with me. This is our run, chat. I'll go and get all it. of us. Thanks. <laughs> Take the wheel for a minute. Oh, you should, dude. Hundred percent. This. I was actually looking at um, learning a ranged mode, but I need to get Duck Station working because that was recently accepted. I mean, that's that's the emulator you use for Dino Crisis, if I recall. 
I want to see how it compares to PSX Fin or Jin. From my like experience with emulators, I like the fact that with PSX Jin you just plug and play, and it does kind of feel like and look like the console. Oh, that must be it then. Oh, rude, you're gonna vomit on me? Oh, me? Do, do you know who you're talking to? It's good, but slower loading time. So, like, would that make much of a difference on Rizzy? I suppose there might be, like, an extra second here or there, like, after the door transition. But either way, I, I would really like to learn the arranged run. I, I, in fact, if I knew how, I would port arranged mode over to PC myself. It would be really easy, to be honest. I mean... I don't really know how to mod, but in comparison to some of the bigger and better mods that we've seen, all it is is just moving some of the new backgrounds that they made, and moving the items or whatever. Because to have a ranged mode on PC, that would be very nice. Nice, no choking here. Well, I guess we're going to have to try and do this glitch now, aren't we? Kind of don't really want to. Kind of afraid we'll fuck up here. But if we do successfully pull it off, we're saving a little bit of time. Which apparently is kind of what you're supposed to do in a speed run. I mean, I have no fucking idea. Couldn't. It's news to me that you're supposed to play these games quickly. Okay, moment of truth. Okay. Okay, I can I can I can I can work with this. Save like a second, but it's okay. Didn't save as much time as I thought it would, but it's whatever I guess.
But it is because well, I guess we just didn't line up properly the first time. We probably could have saved an extra couple of seconds. So there's some optimizing on that. I've forgotten how to dodge that dog for some reason. Like, I just cannot for the life of me remember. But anyway, I hope everyone's having a good uh, Thursday today. Almost a week out from Resi 8. Yeah, that, that, that'd be the mod doing its work, man. <laughs> Lord, the Lord of the Necropolis taking over you slowly, man. Honestly, after playing that for just a, like an hour the other day, I was exhausted. Like mentally. <laughs> it's like, oh, I fucking can't do this game. You enjoyed it, but playing it. Yeah, it's one of those things. You play it, <laughs> becomes a, a little less enjoyable. It's it's like I said, it's it's a good mod, but some places are fucking bullshit. That worm fight is is enough to make me not want to play it. Cause the rest of it so far, I would say, has probably been a little challenging. You know, with some bullshit sprinkled along in some places, but that worm fight was ridiculous. Just getting stun locked by Fucking, uh, yeah, no, Lewis gave me the same strat too, but I just, I couldn't get it down. I just, I think I, I only had one red and green. Maybe I just needed more healing items, and I do have a save like five minutes prior to it, so maybe offline I'll uh, kind of redo that section and get to the worm. I just really was not having fun with that fight. So I was like, you know what? We're going to put this away for a little bit. Didn't have to use the fast. I mean, that's why, like, there's a lot of things in that mod that I love. And that whole, you know, choice of, you know, first aid sprays or increments. That's one of the things I really like. Really makes me very reminiscent of those days where it's like, you've only got a handful of increments left and you don't really know what's coming. Son of a bitch. Come on. What the book in now? GG, boys, it's over. To me, the way I saw that worm fight was that the worms were there to throw off your aim. Because that's what it felt like to me. Like, I'd be sitting there and I'd go to aim onto the, the actual worm and then it'd aim onto the tiny ones. And at that point, I'm like, okay, I'm, I've got to put my hands up here and say this is bullshit. <laughs> I 
I was told shortly after that, like, the game does get a bit more, get, get a little less bullshit, a little bit less meme after that fight. But, um, we'll find that out another day. Taking a big old break from that. <laughs> I mean, it, it, I guess it doesn't help on my half where, like... You saved me. Yeah, that's, that's what I heard, too. Like, it calms down after the city. Don't mention it. And... To be honest, I'm more, I'm, I'm mostly excited for the hospital sections because I've seen a little few, uh, I've seen a couple of seconds of gameplay from there, and it looks like some things were done to, to that section. But that'll be for another day. Like I said, I think I have a bad tendency to like kind of stick to when, when I want to speed run a game or focus on like a project, I like hard focus on it and make it the only thing I play for like a week. And I guess it's because when we were learning the trilogy, right? Yeah, no worries, dude. Good luck. I guess when we were learning the trilogy, it made sense because we would grind like a scenario for like a week or two. But now we've learned the original trilogy, and we can kind of just run whatever we want. Just trying to think of what run I want to learn next. in that mansion that we can't get into because they're locked up i have been looking around for clues okay I'll let's split up and look for clues clue. will you do that i'm counting on you somebody needs to make like a uh, a parody of resident evil that's just scooby doo like the crew from scooby doo Having to go through this mansion. Let's find out who was under the mask of this tyrant the whole time and they just rip off his face, thinking it's a mask. It was Wesker the whole time? All right, Yawn, I'm going to knock you clean out, pal. Let's go. Jill, have you found anything interesting? Yes, but I can't see very well. How about going down to check by yourself? I have anyway, yeah. Here. Um, on the bright side, though, well, then I'll try to go down using I remote. did download an invisible enemy mod um, for Resi 1. I was going to play it the other day. Um, I was actually I was going to do some speed runs on it. You know, not not as a serious thing, but as kind of like, a, okay, how much can we remember of this game? The enemies will always stay in the same place. Shall we see what we could do? Um... But I want to just ha I want to mess around with it a little bit. Also, I yes, I still have that challenge to do. I think mostly everyone and uh, the challenge has been around longer than than mostly everyone here because I'm just really, like, I've just been really into the speed run and grind. But I did have a community challenge like several months ago to finish Resi One Remake on Invisible Enemy Handgun Only Mode, and we'll get there. 
We'll get there, boys. Don't worry. Okay, this is good. I like this. I've unintentionally found. Like I know, if I recall correctly, you can do that. Well, you don't have to run into that little crevice to to grab both the items. Almost ran to do the crank. Like it came off my mind. I was like, okay, let's do the crank first. Nope. Let's not do that. Okay, I can rock with that. Yo, Jordan with the 11 months. Let's go, dude. Thank you so much, man. Well appreciated. Thank you for your continued, continued, continued support. Well appreciated, dude. Your continued. Soon. Oh, you're very close. Very close to that final badge. From the start by Umbrella. Ah. Wow. Enrico. Who killed him, I wonder? So I was going to say. All right, let's... No, no talking, just winning. That's just all we do here. You fucking idiot. There you go. <laughs> oh, we were still gonna... We should save sometime here. He says... Unsure if I actually am gonna save time here. So if I grab the wrong, if I use the wrong crank and we lost no time there, that means we did that in our PB as well. Oh, 
Hi, Black Tiger. Bye, Black Tiger. You bitch. You son of a bitch! We were getting that line up so perfectly as well recently. You didn't think of the smell, you bitch. Some more always sunny quotes there. So I suppose I open the book in here. On the PB. No, I don't. Okay. One, two, three, four, four and a half turn. There you go. Nice. Now we open up death book one. We're going to lose time here, I guess, on the PB. I just forgot to open it. We will lose a little bit of time here, but we'll gain it back. We actually still might lose some time here. Yeah. Okay, so the cave was okay, but kind of wonky on every. Actually, everything went really well. The only thing that went a little bit funky was our uh, menu in. Okay, not bad. No misspellings or anything, so. Nice play. Oh, thank you, man. I appreciate that. This has been a pretty decent run. Uh, some easy time save as well, so we could potentially continue to PB. So. We could potentially gain more time through this. I was looking for you. Oh, yeah, man. I mean, um, it's definitely exploded in the... I mean, most of the people I've seemed to have met have been doing this... 
only over the past like year or so to be honest it's been one of those things where like people I guess there's always been a speedrunning community but it's just grown over time I met someone who loves Resi 7 and loved it and expanded yeah that's always the way man you always end up watching one game and then you end up expanding I used to love watching GTA uh, classic GTA speedruns like number 3 Vice City San Andreas I love Resi 7. Yeah, Resi 7's great, man. It's been way too long since I played it. Well, you don't have to worry about anything. Because you'll be free from this world very soon. I do. I, I was watching uh, Josh play the new game plus category. It must have been a couple of weeks ago now. But it was a lot of fun to watch. Anyway, this disaster cannot be made public. That's why having stars nosing about is so inconvenient. So you're a slave of Umbrella now, along with these virus monsters. It's it's insane as well because like, what makes Resident Evil games so much fun to speedrun is that they're kind of built to be played like this. With the whole timer and the ranking system at the end of the game, showing you like how you did, like it's, it eggs you on to do better, it eggs you on to be faster. And obviously I can only imagine like, I would love to see some developers to, for this game to be able to see somebody beat it in, in, the, in the time that it takes to beat it. I think everyone's first playthrough always takes like 6 to 12 plus hours. You know, you're exploring every room, you're killing every enemy and it's crazy to see how optimised this game can truly be. Playing something else? If you succeeded in developing the world's most powerful biological weapon, what would you do? What would I do? It's a great question, Wesker. You must stop this now. You're a brave girl. But if I were you, I wouldn't give up such a big discovery. You guys are idiots. <laughs> Kinda wish I like made time. I mean I could probably could play Resi 7 over the next like week or so before it comes out. We could always revisit it. It's not as if it's going to disappear or anything. <laughs> Resi 7, now gone. From existence. I'm very excited about Village as well because I've just kept my head down. I really haven't, I haven't played the demos. I haven't watched the gameplay trailers. I've only ever seen the first initial reveal. Um, and then I think maybe one trailer after that. But I've really kept away from everything. I mean, there's some things you can't avoid, like the whole All thing about uh, the lady. I can't remember her name. Lady something. Begins with a D. Don't be upset. Big tall vampire woman that everyone loves. <laughs> That's her real name. The mystery or something like that? The mystery? I don't know. I don't know. We'll find out anyway. I think I'll play it on stream day one. I mean, that was a pretty good fight, to be honest. Nothing quite like watching Barry die on PB pace. It's you. <laughs> go, go, go. Barry? Just leave me. Go, go quickly. 
I'm really embarrassed. Wesker's dead. Is that so? Jill, will you do me a favor? This is my last wish. Please. Can you just die faster, Barry, please? It'd be really nice if you'd be so kind. Will you? You just die now. Forgive me, Jill. Okay. Oh, boys, it's going to happen. GG. So that's a new PB by potentially eight seconds. Let's fucking go. Come on, game. End. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Oh, my God. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> hey, there we go. Look at that. 39.36, the new PB. We did it, boys. All right. There we go. And that was our first actual... Pro I mean, we reset it once, but that was our first run of the day. First completed run of the day. So, new PB. Let's 